The first P for making friends for people with Asperger's Syndrome is perseverance. I would like to consider this the master virtue. Virtually every other virtue you can have to achieve a goal stems from this. Perseverance when you're making friends is very important if you have Asperger's Syndrome because it's likely going to be very, very difficult. What to other people snapping their fingers to someone with Asperger's Syndrome is like climbing Mount Everest. And it can be very, very difficult. So it can be very easy to get discouraged. But we don't want to give up. There is hope. Now one of the things I find most hopeful is hearing inspiring stories and gaining perspective. One of the best examples of this is Jim Rohn's commentary on the parable of the sower, the Bible parable, where he applies that to business settings. And he says in that parable there are examples of how you can attract people initially but then they fade away and then you attract people and they last a little bit longer and then they fade away just like in the Bible story. And then you eventually get to the point where there's people who are coming who are giving you more and more of what you want. He says 30, 60, and 90, or rather 30, 60, and 100. He says you don't want to question it, you just want to go with it. And I think this is very wise. And I've seen this in my life. There are people who will be with me and then they'll go, anything will make them go. Now when that's happening, it's very frustrating. It's very disappointing because you think that's all there is there. You get cynical. You say, hey, what can I do about this? But the good news is there's something more on the other side. You are right in assessing certain people as bad. Not everyone's good. Not everyone is good for you, certainly. So thus, it's important to see that perspective. Also realize there's more to the story. You need to see the whole perspective, and that's where hope gets in. If you can just hang in there, if you know where it's going to go, you can see it through to the end. That doesn't make it easy, it makes it much easier. Like the Bible verse says, where there's no vision, the people perish. And you can have friends. You may have to go through a whole lot of duds, whether it's romantic or otherwise, to get to the end. And I think it's possible. I'm starting to see the light at the end of the tunnel. I can't quite say I'm there yet. But I'm starting to see that. And that can happen for you too. Just look to the end, see the perspective at the end, and allow that to give you the encouragement you need when you struggle day to day. No matter who you are, no matter what you sell, what you're promoting, what you represent, there's going to be some constituency out there. There's going to be some market out there. And that's the way it's set up. Our benevolent creator made it that way, thankfully. Now you will have to go through a lot of garbage, a lot of duds. Whether you're dating duds, you'll have to go through a lot of duds before you get to the good ones. And this is if you're male or female. If